They're all in. Ready. They're off for the Windsor Castle Stakes. 23 of them break from the stalls. Away to the left. Scoops Ahoy. The white sleeves is up with the early pace. Uh, so too Lieutenant Rask in a yellow jacket and mayonnaise. Barnwell Boy in the white and dark blue. And Alabama is over in that left-hand group with Action Point, the brown cap. Towards the centre in the sheepskin noseband, Sergeant Wilco up with the leaders with Sir Bolton in the uh, red cap. Also there, Bombay Bazaar in the grey maximum impact with Inquisitively and Hackman and Johannes Brahms in the blue and orange just behind him with Ganesha and supersonic man and they're already moving down towards the last couple of furlongs spread right across the course here towards the uh, right of the group big evs is running a big race in the noseband from world of darcy halla emirati trying to get on terms over on the far side alabama but it's big evs in the noseband in front as they come inside the furlong alabama is over on the far side then barnwell boy johannes brahms is keeping on stoutly with inquisitively but it's big evs for a big shock in the windsor castle yeah Hannah's Brahms up for second, tight third inquisitively in Alabama, and they were followed home by Up the Manor. Well, 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 Nick Appleby's horse is back in flying form, and he gets himself a Royal Ascot winner with big ebbs in the hands of Jason Hart. Wow, what a performance. Not only does he win, Jamie, he does it really, really easily, beating the 12, Johannes Brahms. Superb by Nick Appleby. Brilliant for him to have this big winner. And don't forget on the back of Anna running eyeballs out in yes. the Kingstand Stakes. It's been a quiet spring for Mick Appleby, but boy, they are back now. And I suppose, Freddie, this part of the story, of the main story, is of course Mick Appleby. But Blue Point set up like he was going to be running riot this year, and it just that train has slowed down a little bit. Was significant that he's now got a Royal Ascot winner. Oh, this is just the making in the first season, sire. He's 12 from 44, from 42, excuse me, Alex. Uh, he's <laughs> he's got an unbelievable start. Look at this horse. This is only his second start ever. He got beaten by Halla Emirati, who went through the Goss London ring there on Monday night, unsold for 150,000. There he is in the white to the right of the picture. But look, this horse is just way too good. Big F's. Massive boost for Blue Point and Godolphin team, I have to say. And well done to Mick Appleby. Jason Hart, another Royal Ascot winner.